Hello again, this is Dimitri from Laptop Media and today I'm doing an unboxing of one of the four cheap and cheerful products that I made a short video on a couple of days ago. So let's see what this box has on the inside. Okay, so let's see what's inside the package of this product, a Data A150 power bank. Alright, um, on the surface we see several reminders of the merits of this device, like uh, its fabulous design, uh, dual USB charging, um, the fact that it's compact, the fact that it has a multi-circuit protection, etc. Let's see what's inside, I'm very curious to, to learn that. Okay, let's take this out. Alright, so here we have the regular user manual, but there's no need to go through it now. Okay, um, now this is the device in all of its glory. This is a very decent looking um, USB cable that you can use for charging the device itself or for charging your uh, mobile phone, tablet, etc. Now, this is an affordable power bank and yet the choice of materials is really premium. Let's see, okay, so it's brushed aluminum indeed, feels very good in the hand, a bit hefty though, it's around 220 grams, some product information on the back, other information on top, nothing here except for the interesting data inscription and the important things are here on the bottom you can see this is obviously the power button and we have two ports okay this one on the right is used for charging smaller devices such as your smartphone and this one on the left is used for charging bigger devices such as a tablet let's say this is the micro usb port where you uh, through which you you charge the battery itself and This is a small LED indicator. There are four lights giving you information about the level of power that's left in the bank now um, This device is very good not only about uh, because of its large capacity uh, But also about its style. I'm really impressed. I haven't seen such a design on an affordable power bank like this one um, so this is good for teenagers who are after Pokemon Go let's say it's good for people who make and take a lot of phone calls and it's also good for amateur photographers and not only amateur of course many compact cameras these days um, have issues with battery life or even some more professional mirrorless cameras so, uh, if you're in need of such a device, this is a very good choice. Uh, you'll find a link in the description below through which you can purchase this device and a link to our article. That's all from me for now. Catch you in the next one, guys.